Big Heavy here, and I am pretty mad right now because I just tried filming a video and it did not go very well because I got really confused and I didn't have the the it recording while I was trying to film. So I got really mad about that. But uh. okay, so anyway, um, I'm gonna be doing a makeup collection today. Because, I, just, I don't know, I felt like it. Um, um, also, I have a couple of announcements. One, I'm going to be doing a couple of hauls. Um, like, clothing hauls and stuff like that soon. Two, I'm going to be doing a What's My iPhone video as soon as I can. And three, uh, this one's really exciting. So, I have officially gotten a vlog channel. So, I'm very excited about that. And... It probably won't have uh, as many videos on it as, anyway, as I was saying, I have a new vlog channel and it probably won't have as many videos on it as I have on this one because it vlogs and if it does, well then, good for you guys. Basically on my vlog channel it's just going to be me kind of showing you stuff that I do in the day, maybe like routines I do, um, I don't know, stuff like that. And you'll just kind of get to see my life and how I live it. So, that should be good for you. But yeah. So anyway, um, I'm just going to be doing a makeup collection today and it's just going to be pretty simple. I'm just going to take each piece and say how I rate it out of five and where I got it from. So, let's begin. Oh, and also, something else I need to say, but I really cannot remember. Oh yeah, go and subscribe to my new vlog channel, and yeah. So, first off, I have three lippies. And this will look like, it should look like that. So, I have Cover Star High Shine Lip Crayon in Candid Coral. Cover Star High Shine Lip Crayon in Raspberry Crush and Disco Pink. And they just look like this. I got them from a magazine and I rate them... I would say 5 out of 5 because I love these. I really do. So, And then I have three little lip, little lip glosses. And so they look like so they don't really have colors, but here's like a darker pink, a very light kind of white pink, and then a pretty pink. And <clears throat> they are this color collection lip glosses, and they're 0 0.9 milliliters. And I just got them from a little set that someone got me for Christmas, so that's really cute. And I rate them; they're really shiny, so I'm probably gonna rate them about. Five or four, five or four, no, four point five out of five. And then I have two chapsticks. So I have the chapstick cherry one, and the Shrek Forever After chapstick. And I rate them both out of. No, I rate them about three out of five, and. I got them, well I got these ones from supermarket, no not supermarkets, uh, pharmacies I have around the corner so yeah. And then I have two lip balms, so I have the Nivea Hydro Care lip balm, and it looks like that and I rate this a 5 out of 5 because it's just so nice and I got this from a friend I think, yeah I got this from a friend because it was one of her recommendations and then she bought me one. So this was absolutely amazing and I love this lip balm. And then I have the Maybelline Baby Lips in, uh, I can't remember what one it is, I, I can't remember now, but it just looks like that. It's probably the most famous one out of all of them. And it's very hydrating and I'm going to give it a 4 out of 5 because um, it just, it's nice and it smells really good but it doesn't last as long as that and I got mine from Soup Drug. So and then I have this lipstick. This is the BYS Longwear lipstick in the shade Cha Cha and I like this one a lot. I'm gonna rate this a 
four. No, a five out of five because it's really nice. Doesn't give off too much colour though. <coughs> so I wanted a nice natural lipstick for school. And yeah, and I got this from Rowan's Pharmacy. So and I have these two little brushes here. And I got these from <coughs> a little brush set. I rate these about five out of five because I really like these and I love to use them for eyeshadow. And they're just really nice and I bought them from again a pharmacy. I then have these little lip balms. So I have this blue shimmery one, I have this red matte one, and I have a brown chocolatey colour. And I rate these, I got these from like um, a, a little makeup set I got when I was younger. And um, I won't rate these too high because I don't really use them. I'd probably rate them like a 2. No, actually I'd probably rate them a 1.5. Yeah, because I don't really use these very much. I'm not really bothered. And then I have this. This is the So Kiss Me lip little balm thing. And this actually gives out a lot of colour. And I think this is a really nice colour for fall or autumn, whatever you call it. And it's like a, a burgundy colour. Or like a maroony colour. I can't remember how you say it, but... Bethany, Bethany Motor really likes these, so. Also, go and subscribe to Bethany Motor because she is, like, the bomb.com, so. Just saying. I then have two bronzers from Laura Page. So, I have the Laura Page Bronzing Powder, which is probably my favourite because I want, like, a natural bronze. I don't like, like, powders where you get loads of it and then you just, it literally brown on your face. I like it to be lighter than that um i like it to be basically like a powder for me so that's what it looks like it's really pretty and um i bought it from again a pharmacy and i rate it a five, no, i rate it a five five out of five yes i really love this and then the other one is this bronzing stick, and I don't use this as much, but it's almost gone. Because I used it for something, but I can't remember what. And, yeah. I think it's really nice to travel with you. I think that it's really pretty, and it just looks really nice. So, that's that, and it smells amazing. And I've already rate that like a 2.5 out of 5. So... And then I have this eyeliner. This is the Laura Page Perfecting Liquid Eyeliner in Brown. And this looks like that. It's just, just this. I got it off of a pharmacy. And also I rate it a 5 out of 5 because I love this. I love to use it. Um. So yeah. Then I have this BYS. Silver Shimmer Shine Pencil um, in one, and it's just silver, basically. It says they had, like, different colours, and it just looks like that, because it's quite old now. But I like using this, and I got it from, again, a pharmacy, and I rate it, uh, I probably rate it, like, four out of five, this. Oh, yeah. I have a small little lip gloss, which was, again, from So Kiss Me. And I got it out of the magazine, as it said, and it's just really nice. Um, I'm not really going to rate it because there's no really point. I then have two of the same brand products and two of the same products, just different colours. I love these. These are like my babies, so I don't wear them every day, but they are really nice. I just think that... The sound that they make when you clap them together, it's really nice. I think they're a really nice, um, a really nice, like, length, I guess, or, like, a really nice shape. Um, I love the way they've done it, so they've just, like, put the colour, and then they've put, like, the really cute, like, shiny label. I also love the fact that they're pointed. They smell like cocoa butter, which you don't really get, but they smell like it. And it smells amazing. And then they're just lid... And I love the fact that they put a lid on it. 
and I love the packaging. Packaging is probably my favourite thing about them, as well as they're really opaque when it comes to colour. So maybe I should just do like a whole review on these because I have so much to say about these. One, packaging. Two, colour. Three, they're just amazing. Um, and they're from Rimmel London. And then the lasting finish colour rush. And here's Make Me Blush, which is like a light colour that I got for school. And then Boom Chica Boom, which is a Boom Chica Boom. And it's just like a darker pink colour. And I love these. I love when you put them together, they clack. And <clears throat> yeah. And I got them from Super Jug, because that's like the cheapest place to get them. And they are. I rate them like a 5 out of 5 because I love these. So I'm like in love with them. They're amazing. And then I have this MUA or Makeup Academy uh, Kiss Proof Lip Stain in the shade Fruity Licious. And it does smell. Fruit delicious it smells absolutely amazing. It doesn't have as much colour now because I think it's running out slightly because it's basically a pen. This pen also it's drying out very quickly. Yeah, it's drying out very quickly, which means it's which means that it's it's drying out a lot, but. I have had it for a while and it's just really nice and I love this. I rate this a 4 out of 5. Oh, and I got it from Superdrug. Did you guys hear that? I got it from Superdrug. And a disclaimer, I have other things, um, like things like, yeah, but they're not really proper brands, so I'm not really going to show them. This is the Laura Page Cover Stick Concealer in medium. And it just looks like that, bit which that. And this is good, I like this. Uh, I get rate it a 3 out of 5 and I got it from Farms. The Summer Love Shadow and Glow Palette by Barry M. Uh, just looks like that inside. And I got it from Superdrug and I rate it a 3 out of 5. Okay, uh, this foundation from Laura Page is in Temptation. And it looks like that. And I rate it a... Three point five out of five. Makeup Academy uh, blusher in the shape Cupcake, and I rate this like a, a four out of five, and it's so really nice, and I really like that. And I got it from Super Jug. The Laura Page City Color Eyeshadow Palette um, in the shade Set to Plum, and it's really nice. And I got it. I see that dropping out. Not even right. Anyway, um, it's really nice, and my mum got it for me from the pharmacy, and as a little treat, and it's really nice. It's got some really nice colours in there, and I rate it a five out of five because I really like that. It's very really nice. Okay, and then I have a couple of other things I just kind of want to whiz, whiz through because I'm getting really impatient sat here. Um, the Laura Page Lip Glide, the Keep Calm and Kiss Lip Balm, the Laura Page Kabuki Brush, the Laura Page Longwear Lipstick in Lilac Whisper, the Laura Page Foundation Brush, three Laura Page Nail Polishes in Fuchsia Fiesta, um, Love Boat, and Pouty Purple. And then, oh no, that's not a brand. Then I have the Laura Page eyeshadow in Castaway, so a really nice blue, and the Be Vivid eyeshadow in Ballet. The Beauty UK eyeshadow collection in palette number seven, Naked. And then the last thing I'm going to show you guys um, is the Two True Three in One concealer in Light. So keep in mind guys that um, I kind of got like bored of showing you the stuff that wasn't brand related because I figured there was no point in showing you things that wasn't brand related because they either came from makeup sets or magazines and yeah you might not be able to get them anymore but um, at least if they're brands you can search them up so 
that I still have like a couple of things left over that aren't from my brand but I'm not going to show you them because I don't really see any point even though some of them are in my everyday makeup routine for instance a mascara that I have down there but um yeah anyway I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I know like one of my makeup collections is quite small and I just want to say that I'm not bragging at all I just decided to do this video um I could have better makeup I there are people on YouTube with bigger collections and better makeup than I have. But this is mine right now. It's going to expand the more and more I do YouTube videos. But yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this. And check the disclaimer below for videos coming up. And um, just like things if you want to catch up with me. And I'll also be doing a question a day if you want to look at that. And also below I will... I won't have these things link, but I will have like a couple of messages saying to go subscribe to this person. And then I have also, I'll just put all the brands in the description box below. Or like, uh, yeah, I'll just have like the brands in the description box below. And then just some amazing products that I want you guys to go and check out. And yeah, and don't forget to subscribe, like, or comment below on this video or on my channel. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I will see you next time. Bye!